Hello everyone, my name is Mara, and today's case is about Madeline Kingsbury, who was only 26 years old when she went missing on March 31st of 2023 from Winona, Minnesota. And just a quick reminder that I try to do the very best research and get the most accurate information I can for every single case that I cover. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get into today's case. Madeline Jane Kingsbury is 26 years old and a mom of two kids who are two and five years old. It's said that she is hardworking and a very devoted mom to her kids. Madeline is also a grad student at the U of M and works for the Mayo Clinic. On the morning of March 31st of 2023, Madeline brings her two children to daycare around 8.15 a.m. She then comes back to her home to get ready for work, but she never ended up showing up for work, and they said it's completely unlike her to not call in or not show up for work. The dad of her kids said he left around 10 a.m. that morning in her 2014 dark blue Chrysler Town and Country minivan. But when he returned back to her home, Madeline was not there. She also did not pick up her kids from daycare or make any arrangements for anyone else to pick them up, which is completely out of character for her. Authorities believe that there was a similar van seen driving around on March 31st around the hours of 10 a.m. and 1 p.m. It was driving on County Road 12 and Highway 43 in Winona County and then seen southbound on Highway 43 through the eastern part of Fillmore County. Then later on, this van was seen driving back towards Winona on Highway 43. Madeline's van was then parked back at her home around 1.30 p.m., but there was still no sign of her. Her jacket that she had been wearing that morning, her phone, and her wallet were all found by the authorities in her home. It said that her kids are safe and that there's no suspects in her disappearance at this point. It's also believed that Madeline left involuntary and that she might be in some type of danger. Authorities are asking residents and landowners in eastern Fillmore County to check for any signs of disturbance or suspicious activity. They are looking for information during the time frame from March 31st at 8 a.m. to April 1st at 4 p.m. To see if there's any sign of her van driving past or stopping or maybe they could even see into the vehicle somewhat to see if it was Madeline in it or if it was somebody else driving it. I was watching the press conference where her family and different authorities spoke and um, her sister, her older sister is actually one of the ones that spoke and you can just tell how missed and loved she is and that they're worried and that this is just completely out of character for her that they do not believe that she would just pick up and leave her children, leave her family. Madeline's family also announced that they are offering a $50,000 reward for anybody that has any information leading to her whereabouts. I'm also going to link the numbers for the Winona Police Department and any other authorities that you can contact if you have any details about any part of this case. And if you think you know anything or if you remember anything, any little detail could help find her, so please speak up. I just really hope that this family is able to get some answers and have Madeline safely return home so her kids and her family know she's okay. This is a pretty new case, so there isn't that many details at this point. Um, this is all kind of what I've seen overall so far. So if there is any updates or any of that, I'll post another video. I really hope I'm able to just post that she's home safe with her kids. But I think that's all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching today's video, and I will see you all next time. Bye.